Hello and welcome to Career Ride. This is Nishant and I am going to talk about mean and mern stack developers, their demand in the market and which one to choose for the fast growing career and salary. So let's get started now. Now both mean and mern stack offers full stack development. Now let us understand what is full stack development. Full stack development is the end to end application development that involves both front end and back-end technologies. Front-end technologies help in designing the portion of application that users actually see and interact with, such as a web page. And some of the well-known front-end languages are HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. Now coming to back-end technologies. Back-end technologies help in developing that part of application that the user cannot see. Backend helps in building services that process business logic, access resources such as database, file servers, cloud services, etc. And the backend portion is built by using languages such as PHP, C, Java, Python, Node.js, database, etc. Now, you know, some software developers may specialize in front end development and some may specialize in back end development, but there are developers who can work on both front-end and back-end development and these developers are called full-stack developers and because they can work on both companies don't have to hire separate developer for front-end and back-end work in fact companies prefer hiring those who can work on both since that reduces development cost significantly so now there are many technology stacks that full-stack developers use among all stacks, mean and mern stacks are the most popular technology stacks that are used by developers to build web and mobile applications. And the reason is quite obvious that these stacks have made application development far easier than earlier. Now let us try to understand a bit about these stacks. Both mean and mern stacks are open source and JavaScript based full stack technology. They helps in building dynamic websites and mobile applications. Mean is an abbreviation that stands for MongoDB, ExpressJS, Angular, and Node.js, whereas the term MERN stands for MongoDB, ExpressJS, ReactJS, and Node.js. All right, so these are very important and popular stacks. Now, both these stacks provide ultimate user experience, stability, and scalability to the application. But there are differences and the major difference between mean and mern stack is the use of angular and react mean stack includes angular while mern stack has react js framework now angular is a complete framework and it uses typescript as well since it is a complete framework you will certainly see a steeper learning curve with angular whereas react is just a library where you don't have much learning curve. React also offers better documentation than Angular, which makes it easier to learn. React is also preferred for mobile development, but Angular offers better productivity. So both mean and mern stacks have many similarities, but they also offer several advantages. You know, Angular has been very popular framework and it is regarded better for large scale applications. But in recent years, React is overtaking it. And the reason is that React is easier to learn, offers great documentation, and it also offers rapid development of small scale applications. Apart from that, there is major demand for mobile applications and React wins the game here. And that's the reason why Mern developers are in high demand and drawing handsome salary as well. All right, so I'm not going to give you any figure over here because salary varies across different companies, location, work experience, and most importantly, it depends on your skills. Just keep working on your skill and you'll be compensated well, whether you are a mean or MERN developer. But in recent years, average salary of MERN developers are slightly higher than mean developer. And that's all for now. I hope you find this helpful. Thank you and see you next time.